After a disastrous week of winter weather in Texas left many without power, today state officials here in South Carolina are hoping to get a closer look at our own power grid to see how it would withstand the cold. News 19's Kaylin Hagwood joins us now live. She had a chance to listen in to that meeting. She joins us with more. Kaylin. Uh, well, Darcy, uh, today at the governor's request, the Office of Regulatory Staff filed a motion to try to learn a little bit more information about how our state's electric companies like Dominion Energy are working to keep our folks safe should we have a, a power uh, situation like what happened in Texas. And they say that we're actually off to a pretty good start. According to the agency, some electric companies like Dominion have already started taking steps to prepare their system for extreme weather. Now, they say our state is also able Able to pull energy from nearby states in an emergency, which is not something much of Texas is able to do. Still, ORS leaders are hoping to get a closer look at what companies are doing to prepare their facilities and see what improvements can be made. What I would anticipate this process to do is we need to look at what opportunities are there to improve the reliability. Um, take those comments, not just from the utilities, but other stakeholders as well. And also at the same time, I, I think as more and more information comes out about the events that took place in Texas, we will be able to learn, you know, what items or what, what occurred to te in Texas that may or may not be applicable here in South Carolina, but, you know, lessons learned. Well, the Public Service Commission will look over the request in the coming weeks, and the ORS is hoping that within 90 days they can have the study completed. Tonight at 6, I have more from what some of the energy companies are saying about the study and with, uh, whether or not they're going to participate. Darcy? Thank you.